What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, it's your homie, Futuristic Mike, and I'm back with another Power Book 2 Ghost video if you're new. Now, we're going to talk about some characters returning as regulars this season of Power Book 2 Ghost. If you're a fan of power, if you love power, hit the like on this video. If you're new to my channel and this is the first time you're finding me, subscribe and turn on those post notifications so when I post videos on Power Book 2 Ghost, you get them. Now, the creator of Power herself posted it on her Instagram page. She said, I am so grateful to welcome Peyton Ashbrook, Alberto Collin, and the Alex Laprie as series regulars for the next season of Ghost Stars, and to welcome Lamar Tate as recurring this season. Hashtag power never ends. So we're also going to get Kamal Tate, and I think that's pretty cool because we only seen him in Rashad Tate's solo episode in season six of Power. So I think it's pretty dope that he's going to be coming back in Power Book 2 Ghosts. And I guess that also means that Rashad Tate will make more appearances as well. Now, with all these characters returning, it doesn't seem like Lorenzo Tejada's reign of power is going to be ending anytime soon. Power Book 2 Ghosts has promoted this actor who plays him ahead of the show's return. So I can't wait to see what Lorenzo is going to do in season two. Now, Peyton Ashbrook who plays prosecutor Jenny Sullivan, is returning as a series regular, along with Alex Laprie, who plays Tariq's former choke classmate, Effie Morales. Jenny was prosecuting Tasha St. Patrick until the U.S. Attorney's Office took over. Then toward the end of the season, the lawyer started sleeping with Cooper Sacks. And it was funny seeing this because the only ass we ever seen Cooper Sacks get was Pornhub.com. They walked in and this dude was jacking off in season six. It was hilarious. But in season two, Jenny will be on the hunt to prosecute Jabari Reynolds' killer. So Tariq is definitely going to have to hide some things. He's going to be on the run. He's going to be trying not to get caught for killing Jabari. Now, Lorenzo Tejada's need to control his drug operation will clash with the way Monet runs the business. And then Yale student Effie will align with Tariq and Brayden as she grows her drug business, which will cause her to examine where best to lay her loyalties. So we're going to see if she really ends up staying loyal to Tariq. But Tariq is going to have to do a better job at being loyal to the people he loves and that he's close to because Tariq lies a lot. He's going to have to stop that in season two if he wants to keep people around, especially Brayden. Now, Lamar Tate. Like I said, we first seen him in Power Season 6. He will reprise his role of Kamal Tate. He's the older brother to the politician Rashad Tate. But when Kamal becomes involved in the investigation at Stansfield, it could put his career in jeopardy. We know he's a cop and he's probably going to be getting involved in the murder of Jabari and stuff like that. So I can't wait to see what his character is going to bring to the series as well, man. We didn't really get to see his character a whole lot on screen. So I'm excited to see what Kamal is going to be doing in season two of Power Book 2 Ghost. Honestly, man, I'm just so excited that we're getting Power Book 2 Ghost pretty soon. It's already the end of June. You know, we have July, August, and then September, and it'll probably air, to be honest, maybe October. But we do have Power Book 3 Raising Canaan coming in a little less than a month. So I cannot wait for that. And we all know that they're filming Power Book 4 Force right now as well. And they're probably almost done with that. So we got a lot of spinoffs coming. But I just had to make this video and let you guys know that a lot of familiar faces are going to be returning in Power Book 2 Ghosts for Season 2. And it's exciting, especially Effie's character, because I really love her. And I'm just excited to see what Kamal is going to bring to the show. I didn't really care for Jenny. But it is cool that she is returning. I want to see if she continues to sleep with Sax. You know, Sax, he's always up to his old tricks. So I can't wait to see what he's up to as well. And I also think it's cool that Lorenzo is going to be returning. Because they didn't really show his character a whole lot in season one. And I want to see him really running the drug operation. Hopefully he gets out of prison. I hope he starts running it. And then Monet maybe feels like she has to kill him or something to take over. Maybe that's going to happen. We just got to wait and see, but I cannot wait. But what do you guys think of this news of these returning characters? And what do you think about Lamar Tate coming back as Rashad Tate's older brother? Comment down below and let me know.
Keep supporting your boy, and I'll be continuing to bring y'all PowerBook 2 Ghost content in the future. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and smash that notification bell so you can never miss a video. If you guys want to donate to the channel, I got links below to the PayPal and Cash App accounts. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me get out of here, y'all. It's your boy Futuristic Mike, and I'll talk to you on the next one. I'm out. Peace.